Hi guys, my name is Sapi and we are playing Geotastic all around the world map. So let's guess where we are in the world from the location we are dropped in. And we are in Africa, I believe. Where exactly? We see uh, English. Yep. This is English. I don't know why it took so long. Cuckoo. Cuckoo Fresh, that's a cute name. Juwang Hardware. People are driving on the left, I believe. Hmm. Okay. What else? Stephen May now. Okay. Let's go here, maybe. Okay, that's a lot of information we have. And we see the truck, by the way, with a snock, which I assume. Because it looks like Kenya to me. Anyway, with all this English. And the problem is, is it Nairobi or Mombasa? I don't know which one it could be. Which one is more hilly? Actually, neither, I would say. Yeah. Mm, let's look for clue because... We should be able to find some kind of clues. There is a Queen's Hotel. And in which city? Yeah, come on. And show us the address. Driving school. Clean water tank. And snorkel. Oh, okay. We, that looks like a very main area. I am really thinking about going to uh, Mombasa. Hmm. Where else could it be? Where exactly? Looks touristy somewhat. Lots of hotels and uh, shops catering to tourists. And let's look at that sign. Mm, what does it say? Okay, that's just an ad for hot hotel. Mm, where should we go? Should we go? Right. That's a, yep, they're driving on the left, of course. Mm, is it Nairobi or Mombasa? Oh, what a confusion. You know, where is Kiku Kuku? Oh, sorry, it was Nairobi, it was on the outskirts of Nairobi. Oh, Kiku Kiku Town. Maybe if I looked at that, I could have guessed there. So, that was a good start, I would say. Let's continue in the middle of the forest. It seems <laughs> no. Oh, we have a train track with us. That's a nice company. And that vehicle is, looks like it's driving on the right. Right? I mean, we have a long antenna and a red car. That's unique. We have these flowers, which is quite interesting, I would say. Mm -hmm. What is the sun? Do we see the sun? Not exactly. We are in the mountains. Somewhere in possibly Europe. Or is it not? Hmm. These fences look odd. A bit odd. Could be... Wait, uh, can we go there actually? No. Apparently not. This is this car is quite unique. Like I that that is also quite unique. Where should I even mark it? Like feels somewhat cool. Oh, we have soccer and we have English. That is an interesting clue. 
the road is of not of the best quality i would say but we have railway tracks here and electrified railway tracks these flowers i mean i don't know where we get this red car where do we get this red car i'm trying to think where it could possibly be could we be in the biotechs mm -hmm. no i mean i don't think with this road quality could it be mm -hmm. i mean feels eastern european is it part of eu no i see white plates this kind of housing style but it's a bit broken down i would say uh, where do yeah it's not part of eu could it be like serbia serbia isn't is quite hilly isn't it no not northern mm. where else bosnia wait do we have rifts in the sky so it was actually ukraine was it yeah it was ukraine actually oh yeah with the road quality makes sense mm -hmm. yeah because also we saw some english some that's why i got a little confused we saw english i mean it looked english to me i think i saw the word best that's why i was a bit confused but the roads make sense for ukraine and now i know ukraine has a red car with a long antenna it's okay uh, we'll take that because i haven't learned anything about eastern europe like how to spot the location we have normal these guides we are driving on the right we have blue and on the left like blue touch and what else have a range rover yeah it's still a blue touch so gathering these clues we can say 27 we are driving on the right we have to make sure of that i mean of course we are this kind of truck that is interesting that is interesting do we have any reflectors i don't see any reflectors oh that's an interesting looking car so i don't spot any reflectors oh that that'll help us oh i don't remember these where do we get them oh i missed it yeah okay oh, oh. which language was this uh let me think it's it's which one it, is it polish i don't see the street thingy i mean hmm let's look for more places it's does hungary has hungarian has these straight lines on os uh does it does it or does it not i haven't spotted any like this looks similar but Mm, not quite but where else we see that that not boss you right? know uh not check here right mm, no i'm um, where do we get is it in the politics again um in lithuania do we get that 
we see a single dot but not a straight line yet is that so that's a dot unspotted latvia does latvia has that in an out of time okay so it was actually hungry oh it was hungry i looked at s said this name and this uh, scene okay here is s said um, how do we even say that zavasco zavasco i don't know i know hungarian is quite difficult but okay i didn't know we had straight lines on letters as well now i'll keep it in mind uh, i don't think it shows straight lines anywhere maybe it's not on keyboard that's why and it's turned into a comma not a straight line i see i'll keep that in mind and that's hungry oh yeah poland it's okay <laughs> let's move on let's not overthink it now okay we have a big blur humongous blur and what is that okay this blur is irritating where is this where are we africa where do we get this kind of blur a humongous blur apparently uh, it's very green very red soil very uh, i would say rural actually we might be in the middle of a dense forest i don't know why it's barely see anything with this but i know it's it has a very dark red soil apparently that's all we can go mm -hmm. houses wooden houses on stilts i mean i wouldn't call that them stilts but basically on top is that a renault i don't know <laughs> renault duster i don't hmm let me think not senegal not nigeria i believe would it be uganda actually would it be mm -hmm. what else could it be mm, it, i mean the car is blurred so i can't tell there is knuckle or not nigeria we would have car following us so and hmm i'm actually really good we should okay we should try to look for sun okay it's it'll be hard i don't think with this kind of skies we can spot this sun okay that is that a satellite dish that is uh like aiming for the equator and it looks like to be aiming north so we could be in south africa no right could we be in tanzania does tanzania has we could be south of the equator I would say i mean i don't know <laughs> I'm just looking for any clue I can get. I'm not getting many. Wait a second. It was. Oh, it, okay. My like direction was right. We were almost south of the equator. We were actually on the equator. Right on the equator. In South Omi and Principe. Okay now i know how this island looks like so i got the latitude correct it's latitude right yeah yeah latitude correct but not the country 
I didn't know Sao Tome, Tome has coverage. Okay, now I'll take care of it. And I now I know what is this actually? Is this is that also looks part of it? And this is which country is this part of? Bikosur, Bikosur, is it part of this or oh, is it part of Equatorial Guinea? I think. Hmm. Okay, let's move on with that learning to the last round. In okay, we see red on the left. Are, is this Tunisia by any chance? Mm, let's look at that first. No, no, no. We see Ponchior. Could be Tunisia, you know. Or Morocco. Could be either Tunisia or Morocco. Is there a car following us? I think that car is following us. So I have a feeling this is Tunisia. Right? Yeah, we, we have this kind of car. I would say somewhere here this road looks like a very big road actually let's get on this road first maybe we'll find some clue mock nine and what does that say mock nine oh we missed it mock nine pomades uh I'll do we see something like that? Mocknane, Omedius, Auto, something, Auto Route A1. Okay, so we see a lot of C's. Oh, it could be this one, right? Oh, A1 go goes up north as well keeps oh it keeps going up where exactly let's look at the angle okay it's very angly like hmm. so it's a big roundabout and east west north south hmm. it could be any of the crossings I don't see it's A1, but those cities that were mentioned. Uh, uh, bomber days. Let's look for bomber days. Uh, I know I'm butchering the pronunciation. Oh, here is bomber days. So we could be on this very junction. This is A1, right? Yeah. Let's just guess it. Oh, okay. Not it wasn't this junction exactly. Maybe it was pointing towards A1. But it was this junction. And okay. Yeah, makes sense. Makes sense. Maybe it was not A1. It's pointing towards A1. I'll take that. I'll take that. So final results we did all right i would say let's go where we lost the most points so kenya was uh we got the city right that was a great start yeah i need to learn eastern europe <laughs> so we got two on eastern europe uh, and i messed both those up but the worst was the south domain principle now i know how it could look like and rest we did fine so thanks for watching see you tomorrow bye bye